Hello and welcome to another video. This is the painting that I finished yesterday. I've been doing this uh, for two weeks now, I think. Yeah. Um, so I finished it yesterday. I finished off the orangey bits of the butterfly. Did some more to the white to make it stand out a bit more. I know that bit's a bit big. It shouldn't be that big. It's like that on the... But, you know, creative license and all that. So, that's the butterfly. I think the flowers came out quite well, actually, afterwards. They added the white bits to it. Now, I said in the previous video, I think that this bits were supposed to be part of the flower and not part of the butterfly that I took. I put it so I've put them in white. So, they're part of the flower and not part of the butterfly. I put in blue bits, I put in orange bits. I put in this bit of a tenai. These bits of black bits went in. That um, are here. And finished off with the butterfly. Yes, I am calling that finished now. Don't want to mess with it anymore. So that was finished now. Then I went on to do... Um, some more some more paintings that are not finished now um but i was looking in one of my magazines put that around here i was looking in one of my magazines do street scenes and there was a tutorial and it said to do a wash of like light blue mixed with a bit of i think it was raw umber and a bit of white I uh, put less raw rumber in because it made it too brown. So I, uh, I did this as a practice piece just to see how it would work, work out. So I did that uh, first and then I went on to do this, which is an arcade in Cardiff. I had real trouble. You probably know from a previous video that I had a bit of trouble with the tiles and this one is definitely not quite right um i might put in some more these the white the blue bits are going to be painted in lighter color yeah um, or i might just leave it like that but this bit's got to be adjusted i'm going to put something in there to make this look more diamond shaped this bit's okay um something like that across here yeah, that'll do it. So, when I, I, I put the blue over the drawing and I thought I'd ruined it because I couldn't see all the lines, but I managed to figure it out. So I did um, the basic outline of the top of this first, then I started to put in this bit here, that's like this bit here. And um, these lines in here, and now put this in and this in and that in. I was putting my finger in that while I was trying to do the other stuff. When I'd done this side with the lines in, then I then I put in the uh, tiles in the on the path, and then I did uh, this bit and I put the the top of the table in i got to do the um, thingy <laughs> is a stand whatever it's called <laughs> and I, I, I forgot I, no, I didn't notice there's a plant pot here that's a plant and there's some kind of more little pots up there as well and some on this side as well but looking closely I can see I might just put them in later on top to make it look more authentic it's that I can see there. Anyway, I've done um, this bit here is going to be that bit. That's obviously um, I think that's like one of those signs that you put out when you when the shop's open or something. And I've done it a little bit too wide. I can adjust that, and then I've got a bit here of grey to, to show that the floors there um 
It's amazing what you see when you're looking through a tablet and you can see all the mistakes. Anyway, then I do this line scene over here. And then I went from dinner and afterwards I thought I was too tired to carry on anymore so I left it. But that's how it is so far. And that is a work in progress. I also just covered this in a raw umber. Didn't do anything else to that, just covered in raw umber. Little bits of... Uh, it's upside down. Little bits, <laughs> little bits of uh, patchy. Mm. You can only really see it when you're looking through the tablet. When you're looking with me bare eyes, it's a lot darker and you can't see the patches like that bit. I don't suppose it really matters. I'm going to paint over it anyway. But that one is that. And that's how that one's hopefully going to come out. I'm going to practice skies as well. So they're going to do the stormy sky in the, in the background. Anyway, that's what I was doing yesterday. I'll leave you with a look at this one. So that's the end of this video then. If you enjoyed it, give it a like and subscribe. And I'll see you later. Bye.